In this video, you will learn how to share folders in the PyDO6 web application. We recommend that you have seen the file sharing video before moving on to this video. Feel free to click on the annotation if needed. There are two ways to share folders. You can generate a public link for your folder, which is very similar to sharing a file, or you can share a folder as a workspace with application users, which we will review a little later. To share a folder as a public link, you will have the added option of choosing the layout that is best suited for your needs. Here I will choose a standard layout. This layout presents the items in the folder as a standard list. If you click Download All, this will generate a download of a zipped archive folder. Let's now go back to my layout options. Here I am going to select the film strip option because I have a lot of images in my shared folder. I can set up a slideshow to automatically scroll through my files in this layout option. Let's take a look at the embedded layout now. In this layout view, I will see all my files without a header in a simple background format. This can be handy for embedding in an HTML iframe for third-party website publication. The last layout format is called Drop Files Here, and this is a great option for shared folders that you create for external suppliers. For example, your account or architect can easily drag and drop files into the shared folder using this view. Don't forget to enable the upload rights for this link. You can even combine this with the no preview setup, creating a blind drop file. As we mentioned earlier, you can also create a workspace from a shared folder. After you select your folder and click Share, you can choose As a Workspace. As you can see, you can add collaborators from those who already use PyDeo by typing their name in the field. If your application is connected to the Enterprise Directory, you would see all users directly here. You can control the rights that they will have in the shared folder workspace. You can give them the right to read and write files. If you enable the Watch feature, your collaborator will receive an alert any time you make changes to the shared folder. You can easily add a new user to give them access to your shared folder workspace. Simply type the name or email of the user in the Share With field. Then select Create New User. Then you simply fill out the form. You will select the user ID for your new user. When you are finished, you can control the rights that they will have in your shared folder workspace. You can see all of the shared users you have created in your address book from your account. Thank you for watching our video. Stay tuned to pydeo.com for the latest information.